Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a brand new episode of What's Up Sioux Falls. I'm Jason Davis. I am joined today by Craig Livingston, Vice President of Operations for Hydro Green. We are just north of Sioux Falls. I'm so excited about this and I think you guys will be too. This is a homegrown business uh, right in Sioux Falls backyard. Uh, um, we're just north of town at the Renner exit. And what Hydro Green is doing is, I'm not afraid to say, world changing. I mean, this is absolutely incredible. Vertical farming, I'm sure, is a term you guys are maybe familiar with. Um, I don't know if this is, this is maybe just a little different. Takes it, it takes it to another level, pun intended here. Craig, tell us a little bit about where we are and what we're standing in front of. We're standing in front of one of the Hydro Green Grow systems. This system is not vertical farming, we call it vertical pasture. It grows livestock feed every day and we feed this to the livestock every day. And this is live green grass that gets fed to the animals. And it's just an amazing product that does so many wonderful things for the animal. And we manufacture this product that grows it. This particular one we're standing in front of is eight levels tall, so we grow eight levels on it. And it's eight sections long. So it produces over two million pounds of feed a year inside of this little building. You know, you compare that to what you can grow on an acre of ground a year, because you can only grow once a year there. We harvest this every day. So the animals are fed on this every day. We have six of these or multiple of these together. So each one gets harvested every day. So that feed goes to the animals every day. So they get the live green feed. It is such a nutritious feed. It's unbelievable. If you look at this, uh, we plant a seed bed, which grows and it pushes the seeds up and we get some nice white, beautiful roots underneath. And then the green grass on the top, the animal just goes crazy over this. An animal will sort through the feed bunk to find this because it is so nutritious and so tasty. And, the, and an animal knows what's the best thing to eat and they will go after this because it is. And not only does this product get better for the animal, the rest of the ration that the animal eats is totally changed by this product going into it because the moisture absorbs into the other product which contains enzymes which make that product more digestible for the animal. So it's just an amazing thing that happens when you mix this. And that's all before it goes into the animal. So in the feed bunk it's mixing together and in the mixer wagon it's mixing together and just getting better all the time. We don't use any chemicals. We don't use any fertilizer. We use seed, water, and light. That's all we use. And we put it inside of a building that is environmentally controlled. So we control the temperature and the humidity. And we grow it the same every day. So we get the same ration every day for that animal with this product. And we don't have to worry about the snow and the wind, the cold, the rain, whether it doesn't rain, anything. It's all enclosed inside. So you push a button, off it comes, you feed it to your animals, and away you go. Unbelievable. You know, it, it's uh, as we've talked about, farming has been around a very long time and has changed little over the last how many years, how many decades, all things considered. This is completely revolutionizing that because we're taking out the cost of the equipment, right? Yep. We're, and, and you're taking out all of the, the pesticides that people worry about and uh, the weather element, like you said. I mean, it's just, it's absolutely incredible. Well, and then the environmental impact of all that equipment and hauling the, yeah. the, the feed and, and all of that, that's, that's gone also because we're, we're, we're not using anything that's harmful to the air. Uh, we don't use any, you know, big engines or any fuels or, or any of that type of stuff. You know, uh, we do power it with electricity, so we do, do use some electricity. But yeah, so we don't use any of those harmful things for the environment, which is important. Absolutely, amazing. And speaking of electricity, I mean, this is uh, this machine, this your your product is shipping worldwide, right? I mean, basically, that's what's incredible about this is that anywhere that we can get electricity to, it doesn't matter what the land looks like, what the countryside looks like. If you can get electricity and you can build a building, right, to house the machine, you can be harvesting anywhere in the world year round, right? Yeah, we just finished shipping one to Italy here a couple weeks ago. That system will be feeding water buffalo. We can feed almost any animal that eat grass, we can feed with this. And so they're gonna feed water buffalo to make mozzarella cheese out of in, in, in Southern Italy. So it's, it's a great 
a uh, great system for feeding anywhere in the world and any type of animal. And when you get into more desert areas where they don't have a lot of water, they don't have the ability to grow anything, they can bring seed in, put it on the system, produce animal feed, and feed it to the animals to end up feeding it to us. Absolutely incredible. Craig, thank you so much for joining us today. Um, if you guys want to learn more about HydroGreen, uh, visit the website. Uh, Craig, what's the website? HydroGreenGlobal.com. HydroGreenGlobal.com, and I think you guys are hiring, right? Oh, we're, we're going through a huge increase in people. Huge, yeah. okay. So if you're interested in coming to work for HydroGreen and being a part of changing the world, uh, give them a call, visit the website, stop in and see them, and, uh, and be a part of this absolutely incredible team. And I'll, we'll put the uh, website uh, down below. Craig, again, thank you for taking, or taking the time to be with us. Thank you all for joining us on another episode of What's Up Sioux Falls. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.